Hello everyone, and welcome back to the Doctor Who adventure games. When we last left off, we had taken control of Amy, and we are following a green-eyed lady who is possibly a Rutan through the medieval streets of London town, rife with plague. What could possibly go wrong? Um, I actually just had to replay a little bit of it because it decided to pick up uh, before this part, um, where right before Amy had to distract the guard, it decided to pick up there. But this is where we shall... Start today. Let's see where you're headed, green lady, with your glowing eyes. Okay, uh, before we follow her, I know that I need to pick some flowers here, just to save me coming back later. Um, I think we've got to basically pick a fair few flowers um, as the game goes on. Uh, I think there's some over here, but we can't pick those yet. We've got to come back for them later. But anyway, let us see where our mysterious lady of the glowing eyes has gone. And she's right there. <laughs> where are you going? Okay, now, you can explore this whole area, and there are lots of facts around here. But it would take quite a long time to explore the whole place. Um, but I will quickly run around now because there are um, more plants around here. Flowers and things that I need. So I will just have a quick look. I think I know where they are. Um, they're not here, for one. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I do have an idea of where they are. I think there's only three of them I need to get. Uh, and they shouldn't be too difficult to find. Now, there is also... Um, which I didn't actually experience, oh, there's a fact, which I didn't experience in my first playthrough um, when I played this last time. I might be lucky enough to experience it now, that uh, the silence do ever so briefly appear uh, in this game. Little cameo appearances. Oh, more plants. There you are. Oh, she's over there. Uh, they do have little cameo appearances in this game. Uh, when you're not looking, they appear and you hear them. And when they, uh, when you look away, suddenly uh, they have vanished. Tyburn tree. Basically something to hang people with. Lovely. So yeah, I'm not quite sure, quite sure um, exactly where and uh, when they are supposed to appear. Right, I'm slightly lost now. Which way did I come from? No, that's the clay pipe, so yeah, not this way. Yeah, I'm not exactly sure where and when they're supposed to appear. Um, but, uh, it is certainly, I think you, I think you hear them before you see them, so I will certainly hear them before I see them. Ah, I think that's the other plant. And a few of these sweet smelling leaves. Now, again, I'm going to save a bit of time here because I know we've got to come to this woman to mix it all up for us. So let's do this now whilst we're here. Um, again, just to save some time. Because there's a lot of there's a lot of dialogue in this game more so than the other ones, so I'm going to try to. I'm going to try to um, just do the dialogue that I need to know. Um, hear ye, hear oh. ye. King James to open Parliament on the morrow. There we go. One sweet That's never happened to me before. <laughs> I've never heard that guy say something. He he's, he talks later on in the game, but I've never heard him say something now. Um, right, so, yes, we need to go and follow the Miss Lady of Wintars. Let us see. So she came this way. I think she came this way. Aha! So why did so I could have just I could have just so I walked all this up this way for nothing basically. <laughs> Great. Oh, fact. Ch uh, yes, less said about that the better. <laughs> okay. It's going this way. Where are you going? Where is she going? I want to know. I should know because I have played this before, but I can't remember. Where did she go? Where 
Where did she go? She can't come this way. Did she go an alley, maybe? Now to around here. Uh, ah! Why didn't I... Why did I have to walk all the way around? Alright, fine. Maybe that was the point. Maybe they thought, oh, people will go down the end. And then she won't be there, and then we'll surprise them when they come back. Hmm. That's a suspiciously green-eyed cat. Meow! <laughs> right, Gizmo, do your thing. Ta-da! Oh dear. Less than excellent. Amy? Rutan! Oh, Amy! Amy! Now I do vaguely remember this bit. Saving you from being fried to a crisp is as far as I got a plan. I think this bit's all about the... Ow. Uh, yes. uh, probably not that loud for you guys, but it's really loud in my headphones. Um, yeah, so... Uh, this is all about timing. Go. <laughs> run, kitty, run! Come on! Again. I hate shapeshifters. They never play fair in a chase. What was that? A rootin. I'm afraid that must have been what we bumped into. A rootin ship. It's about time the rootins made a comeback. Because we've Guy only ever Fox. seen them... Guido. Well, on so screen, we've only ever seen them once in the horror of Fang Rock. We've heard about them all the time. But we've never actually seen one apart from one time and here. I think it would be really... Because we've always seen the Sontar inside of the wall. But I think it would be great to see... To see the Rutans make a comeback. Because it would be really interesting to see a different side of the wall. And the, I, I believe that there was... I know I'm talking over this, but I don't care. Um, I know that there was uh, some... Let's go and find the word on the... <laughs> there was some kind of, uh, I think it was a new series novel, possibly a classic one, I'm not sure. Um, there definitely was one that said that the Rutans were extinct, which can't be the case if they're here, or at least maybe they're extinct uh -huh, at a certain point in time, but not by this time. So, who knows? Anyway, but yes, I personally would like to see them make a comeback. Doctor, what's wrong with him? He looks catatonic. No doubt a result of encountering the lesion. What, you mean the lesion did this to him? No, his brain did this to him. This is a London town crier in 1605. Yeah. His brain has no point of reference for something like this. He's never seen a temporal portal before, so when his brain can't cope, it closes down. Better tie it up then. Oh, you... oh, I should have. I know you can scan the portals to tell you what's on the other side of them. I should have done that first, really. Uh, and then that one, that one, that one, that one, that one, that one, and that one. Ba 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 da. Sir, I must thank you. This strange wonder has me bewitched. It it sounds like, like um, Phil Daniels. Phil Dan. Phil Daniels. Phil Daniels. Um. And he's been in lots of things. Uh, what were most people known for? Um, he was he uh, was uh, the guy that speaks in the Blur Song Park Life. You've probably Can seen him in something. That does sound a lot like him. Enough, I went looking for the truth behind the wild stories that young Charlie told me, and then I should look it up I on IMDb on, when I'm finished. Many of these gateways appeared about the streets, and it worries me greatly. I do know one thing. I do know, actually is. Uh, is the uh, the kid that plays Charlie in this is the same one that plays George in Night Terrors. You said there were more uh, if you recognise the voice when we finally Where get to meet him. There are two others I know of. I can take you to them if you wish. In fact, I've just looked it up just very briefly whilst I'm doing this, and uh, it is indeed oh. Phil Daniels of Who's Park Life and other things fame. Me with stories of 
traveling through these strange gateways to the house of the Green Lady. So what about this Green Lady? Indeed. Who is she? I haven't seen her myself, but everyone talks of an apparition of a well-to-do lady, beautiful to look at, who wanders the streets after dark. She is dressed in green, and some say her eyes glow like emeralds lit with cold fire. Others say she appears and disappears before your eyes. Okay, Amy, I'm going to go with this Sterling fellow and see if I can deal with the other lesions around here before they tear London apart. And what about me? See if you can find out more about this Charlie Chappie. Chat to people. Charlie Chappie. Yeah, of course, you're good at that. So yes, we have to get the word on the street. And I think I know just who to go to. There is a young chappy around here. Although this isn't Charlie. I'm looking for Charlie. Have you seen him? You stay away from me. I ain't talking to no strangers. You might give me the plague. Which is the reason why we were picking all those flowers earlier. Because medieval times flowers ward off the plague. Posey. Can we talk now? Oh, thanks, miss. Maybe you ain't got the plague, but you got a downright strange. The back of Amy's hair looks like a squid, just pointing that out. <laughs> what do you want to know? Uh, Charlie. Hey, I hear you're a friend of Charlie. Can, um, you help me find him? I don't know where he is. Last I saw him, he reckoned he'd found a way into the Green Lady's house. Said something about some big tunnels near Parliament and treasure there up for grabs. I don't know how right he was, but he was desperate to find a way of helping Annie. Asked me to look after her while he was away. I ain't seen him since. Um. Do I need to know about. Maybe. You're an orphan. That's got to be so hard. How do you manage? Well, I've done all right. When my mom and dad passed on with the sickness, I got sent to the parish. It's what happens to kids when their folks go. But there's nothing for me there. So I ran away and ended up on the streets. But I'm quick. People never catch me. So I'll make enough to get by. A young boy like you shouldn't be pickpocketing and stealing. It's Sorry, I'm literally I'm taking this brief moment to, uh, to to uh, reply to a comment from somebody. I'm fit to work, you see. So if they find me, It'll be a flogging. They're sent back to my parish. The poor laws ain't kind to folks like me. But they've got to catch me first, haven't they? That's awful. You're too young to be living on the streets. You should be at school. Isn't there one you could go to? School, miss? Not me. Uh, but you've hmm. got to have an education. <laughs> there must be somewhere you can learn how to read and write. I ain't got the money for no school, miss. Like my folks couldn't send me to petty school when I was young. Anyway, letters and stuff. They're for the toffs and churchmen. And even if I did get into one of them free grammar schools, how would I make money to eat and stuff? Okay, well, that's not really necessary stuff, but never mind. So, let me get this straight. Green Lady's so-called house. Big tunnel near Parliament. Missing Charlie. Oh, I hope the doctor can make sense of all this. Here we go, sir. It's around that corner. Excuse me if I don't accompany you. After my previous experience, I have little stomach for sorcery. Okay. Sorry, my phone's doing something weird. All right. Uh, so, this one. Oh, we've got to do so. A spot of climbing. Now, as I said, we can. Sc I will scan this one to show you what I mean, but I'm probably not going to scan the rest of them because you don't actually. Sonic Screwdriver will be able to give me more clues. You don't actually need to know what's on the other side. Um, for some reason, it's just not deemed necessary information. <clears throat> but, we shall close it. 
I seem to remember as well, these get progressively harder as you go along. So, we want that one to 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 that one to, no. Yeah, see, this is where it gets... Oh, hang on. To that one. To that one. Done. <laughs> I seem to remember the last one is actually quite difficult. Very well done, sir. I must say I'm impressed with your skill with the arcane arts. Now follow me to the next one. Let's boogie. Uh, oh yes, we've got to get into the yard now. Yes, I seem to remember them. I'm, I'm sure there's something on the ground here I need to pick up. Li it's, it's weird how little bits and pieces come back to me, but the majority of it is gone. Uh, so yeah, so we need to wake up this lady. Psychic paper makes most people <laughs> believe you are who you say you are. I think this is where the psychic paper is going to come in handy. What do you want? It's all right, Margaret. This here is a man on the king's business. Oh, I don't care if it's the risen lord himself. <laughs> Get lost. I think this might help. How is she supposed to? See <laughs> How is she supposed to see it at that angle from that distance? Sorry, sir. Sorry. Right away. At least it worked, anyway. Okay. I do like the way that they've done this, that there is actually something sort of on the other side, and yet when you go around it, there's nothing there. They've they've really put work into the way they've done that. But anyway, uh, time to close it. Now, was this the one that I found quite difficult? I can't remember. So, that one, to that one, to that one, to that one that one why not that one that one then yes I seem to remember I found this one quite difficult um, okay depending on how long this is gonna take me I may cut it out but we shall see I'm pretty sure I start with that one okay so that one let's say to that one then to that one I can't cross over, can I? So let's say... Okay, so it's definitely that one. Maybe I'll start with that one. So that one... To that one... To that one... That's on the same side, so that one... And that one... But I can't cross over, can I? God damn it! To that one, to that one. But that doesn't work then, because I can't get to that one. Okay. Is this... No, I couldn't do that. So it's got to be... Okay, it's got to be that one to that one. Or that one to that one to that one. No, because that's on the same side, isn't it? So it's got to be that. Okay. And it can't be that one or that one, so it's got to be that one. That one, to that, aha, hang on. And then there, to there! <laughs> that wasn't too difficult, I suppose. Oh, okay, there you are. Of course I'm here. I'm having way too much fun to be anywhere else. Now, <laughs> what do we know about Charlie? 
They say he's been following Winters to her house. Her house? Interesting. But that might mean he knows where her ship is. But do we know where Charlie is? He's hmm. disappeared. Last time anyone saw him, he was wet and had been underground near Parliament. Hmm. Do you know anywhere like this, Mr. Plum? Sounds like the Mr. Plum. <laughs> it's such a stereotypical sort of Dickensian, Victorian, ye olde name. Lovely. Who in their right mind would go down there? Uh, and that brings to a close another episode of the Doctor Who Adventure Games. Uh, so yeah, now I think um, one of the upcoming episodes has uh, a sort of one of these cuts in the middle of it because you've got to travel between the different areas of the map. So um, that might confuse me slightly when it comes to editing it, but uh, just generally that seems to work okay. Uh, but yes, so I shall pause here. Rory is in the sewers. I think he's about to encounter some Sontardans. But anyway, as always, I hope you enjoyed this video. Like, favorite, subscribe, share. It really helps me out a lot. Be sure to check out the description below for a link to my Patreon. It would really help me out a lot if you would support that as well. I salute you all, and I will see you with another video very soon.